Well, good Tuesday morning. Good to be with you at 6 o'clock. I'm Ravietta. I'm Rachel Keller, and we have clear skies to kick off this beautiful. Tuesday. Another beautiful day. Yeah. Yeah, so it's going to be great out there. I mean, the lower humidity, again, just making it feel so wonderful early this morning. We've got temperatures that are in the 50s now, and with that low humidity, it almost feels like a fall morning. It's just crisp. It feels great. 59 in Boston, 54 in Worcester, down to 52 in New Bedford, and in Nashua, New Hampshire as well. So you're seeing a fair amount of sunshine out there as we speak, but there will be clouds mixing in as the day goes on. We're likely going to be back in the lower 60s in most spots by 7 or 8 a.m., and at the that point just forget about the extra layers. Uh, an extra layer is kind of handy while it's still in the 50s, but we'll roll into the low in the mid 70s this afternoon. Partly cloudy and for the most part dry. You can see some very, very small rain chances today and tomorrow. That's essentially an isolated shower that might pop up. Friday is the next widespread rain. And of course, you know, we're going to be talking about heat and humidity later this week as well. Here's Kelly Sullivan. Yeah, sure, yeah need the sunglasses today for sure. Yeah, so sun came up at 507 and without we had a lot of pretty color out there. There's some scattered clouds that will tend to mix in today. Sun goes down to 821, but I think the neat thing is that by the summer solstice on the 20th, we're going to gain another three minutes of daylight. So uh, bus stop forecast this morning, temps in the 50s. Feeling a little bit cool. I would encourage you to grab a jacket. We've got afternoon temperatures in the 70s. It's going to be warm. It's going to be comfortable. It is not going to be blazing hot, but it's just it's it's fine to wear the summer things. If the kids want to wear the shorts to school, let them wear the shorts. Just have them 